Hey guys, it's Baldy. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how much the scav case opened up with the 15,000 ruble buyout, okay? So looking at our scav case here, we actually saw that the scavs were offering another bonus for us. They wanted to go ahead and have me pay them 15,000 rubles to go out there in the world to go find some uh, market value items. This scav case right here it was not a good hit, wasn't successful really. For the most part, on the flea, you only had a 26% chance to go positive. And if you sold everything to the traders, you only had a 66% chance to go positive. So again, it helps to you know sell everything on the flea, but some of the items you might be sitting on for a little bit, or if you want, just go ahead and just toss it and sell it to the traders. Time is money. So that's the option here. For the most part, throughout all this, you know, we have ended up spending about 225,000 rubles for the whole 15 runs. The issue is though, is that for the most part, most of the time when we sold things to the traders, we went negative. This wasn't that successful as it was with the 2,500 ruble buyout, but I mean, it still worked out. We still went positive for the most part. So here's the numbers are looking like right now. So the numbers weren't that great this time, all right? So for the most part, you know, we went ahead and sold everything to the traders for about 248,841 rubles, all right? Now the buyout obviously was about 225,000 rubles, which made a net profit of 23,841 rubles, which didn't profit a lot, to be honest. We made money, but I mean, you can make money elsewhere than 23,000. So it wasn't very good there. However, with the flea market, like always, it did pretty well. For the flea market, we went ahead and sold everything to the flea for $467,428, with obviously subtracting the $225,000 fee, the buyout fee, which is equal to a net profit of 242,428 rubles. Now, for the most part, um, we did have two errors uh, on the recording, so two of those items did not show up. I don't think this is as worth it as the 2,500 ruble one. All right, so for sure, skip this one. We'll be working on the third next option tier for the uh, scab case. All right. All right, guys, that's going to end the video today. I appreciate you guys stopping by. One quick announcement real fast. I've decided to actually switch back over to Twitch. A lot of my followers are actually asking me why am I streaming on YouTube and not Twitch. So I've been running some issues with YouTube for the most part, and it's actually stopping my computer and automatically resetting my computer for some reason. I don't know why. I never had that problem on Twitch. So we're actually going to go ahead and move over back to Twitch. We're going to figure it out there. Plus, I didn't think that I gave it the proper growth, you know, that was appointed to it. I can't kind of like jump ship and went to YouTube just because I wanted to try it there and I wanted to build up my YouTube channel. But but for the most part, I think we're gonna hop back over to Twitch for now. So I had a lot of streams already that people stopped by and then they're actually seeing the, the production videos of what we're making in the future. So if you guys wanna help, go ahead and, and catch up with that and get an early bird special, go ahead and follow me on Twitch. But that's it guys. So until next time, we'll be doing the 95,000 reward um, scab buyout next time. So until then, peace.